I just got to creep how you do that. Came out with the bees, how she do that. Yeah, I'm running shit, how we do that. Yeah, ain't no the bees, bitch, I do that. You know. How hard it is to be a beat maker. You have to be there because the whole process involves you going through different tools and instruments and like picking which one sounds right for you. And while you're sampling those tools, it's more of, let's say you're sampling uh, kicks. Then you go to the clicks and imagine that the whole time. Random gun noises, random sounds bang in your ear for hours. That's why it's like to be a producer. That's why I respect those guys. Because goddamn, then out of all that chaos, because it's like a lot of instruments. I don't know if any of you have tried to make a beat, but it's a lot of instruments finding the right one. That's why when and explains why producers stick to one sound because once you've found something that works out of all that chaos I would stick to it too hmm. I think that's why all the producers must have a sound that's why I respect the ones who keep changing it's finding respect to creatives you people finding a structure order out of all that and giving you a bit something that you groove to you know out of this ethos of whatever we get creativity from i arranged this piece of thing that speaks to you on some random sunday when you're cooking or whatever and you just feel the song Respect producers, they they do that. <laughs> now hard it is to get order out of chaos. Uh, there's this theory, it's, it's the chaos theory actually. It's from uh, Professor. It's the lecture on uh, emergence and complexity margins things emerging from nothing and something that stood out for me from that lecture was when you when there's one ant let's take one ant when there's one ant on its own it's just an ant it's some random thing around wandering around it has no goal it doesn't look like it has aim or why it's doing what it's doing other than the basic you know evolution of instincts of hungry fetch you know animals have very basic ones you know data data if it was there's no humans as more complex we question things like morality another time but that's a very complex thing to emerge out of you know so an ant is just there roaming on the ground and not on its own is just an ant two ants yeah Three, four, five, six. Meh, still roaming around, but now something is trying to emerge. An ant on its own does not know. But then anyway, we'll get to that. One ant, eh, ten ants, eh, but have a thousand ants. And something is starting. All of a sudden, they're building an ant hill. Do you think an ant on its own knows? That I'm supposed to build an ant hill. It's not there. They looked. <sighs> they think to take for granted fixed action patterns very, and none doesn't have a fixed action pattern of let's build a home like you have a fixed action pattern of. Take for example, if running animal. It's coming at you, run, 
you know, we have, okay, bats have exception patterns because for them, and nothing. <laughs> but anatomy soon doesn't, but many, and they're building a castle. So an ant here, to them it's a castle. <laughs> And that's how complexity, because you know how complex an anthill is. You've seen the videos of how soldiers are marching to create that complexity, which we even humans have failed at. By the way, if you've ever been in traffic jam anywhere, you know we failed at that. But that complexity out of nothing, because one ant does not have that complexity. A thousand of them, and all of a sudden, the complexity emerges. That's emergence and complexity. I never thought of it like that. My nature was deep, I know. I will now link it if anyone wants to. Anyway, when a room talks, respect DJs because they get this complicated craft of a castle of a song that speaks to you. So you respect beat makers and writers I guess as well. But writers it's more of, I don't know because this is how I write. There are times when I have a bit and I'm like I should write to this but usually it takes slower. Versus one when you're just there chilling, doing whatever it is you're doing and some random beat comes on, you're like, hmm, okay, you start writing something and before you know it, that first, that song is done. Versus Getting the song from that's what it sounds like when you're making a beat. Get up and try because finding the right kick for the right snare and the right melody for the right that's why I think uh, Nesim was like Daddy Andre also knows the formula. They start from the melody side and go backwards. I start from the kicks, snares, da 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 today I feel the rhythm, da 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 then I go and make melodies later. I've not been a melodies guy, and I don't know how to play piano. So, I learned once, learned how to play. Blackstar, Blackstar. Whatever you may be. Well, I don't respect producers. That shit is not easy, bruh. They bring it to you. And you have a masterpiece of a song. Like this one. I need a mercy. Life is good, life is sweet, this is endless They say I'm too much, I say I'm relentless Big dreams in my peace, pushing bands as we're ranging I say we gon' make it and I meant it Leave me big deal, tell them sit still Black speed, that's a slap, call a big wheel And we got zeal, let the drink spill Michael Bat and the sip is the big thrill ah. 